this was not part of the plan. I'm awful on camera, you know this. Tammy, seriously, it's not that big a deal. All you have to do is tell them your name and explain your involvement with the show. Piece of cake. I wasn't promised cake. I call preferential treatment. Would you like to go first then, Wes? Well, since that seems to be the only way I'm getting out of here today... Should I just sit here? Should I look at the camera? Whatever feels natural. Well, I'm Wesley Dean Wright. I go by Wes. And if I were actually doing whatever feels natural, I wouldn't be sitting here. My sister-in-law guilted me into this. I like long walks on the beach, and I do not enjoy talking about myself. I'm a camera operator for this little project. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I'll also be doing some editing and post-production work. Okay, fine. What I meant to say was, I'm a camera operator for this serious, surefire blockbuster of a project. Are blockbusters even a thing anymore? I don't know. Maybe in film. Maybe. But certainly not in our medium. Gosh. I might be an idiot on camera, but I suppose I can't be any worse than him. Okay. You two, let's take five. I'm sorry, it's just so much easier when I look at you. It's fine, Cam. Just do your thing. And hurry it up, I beg you. Between you and Mr. Hotshot Comedian, I'm almost out of battery. And I have to sub in half an hour. Okay. Uh, my name is Cameron James. I'm 24 years old. Uh, I just moved down to Mobile with my college roommate, Blue, uh, to, to assist in the writing of her brainchild. An exciting web series uh, that is sure to revive an age-old classic, creating a new and improved obsession for today's hashtag happy generation. Are we scripting these things too now? No, it's just... Uh, don't worry about it. She's nervous. Also, you're in the shot. That's the point. Oh, Lord help me. Blue, come on. This is the fun part. As you can see, we're new to the web series thing. <sighs> new and determined. Well, what are we talking about? Well, she's explaining the process of the web series to the audience. Um, let's try something different. Tell them about the setting. The setting? Yeah, like how we're going to be... Um... Oh, you mean how we're staging the story like our town? Our town is a play by Thornton Wilder and is unique in how it's performed with a set or props. The actors pantomime the objects they use. Since Beauty and the Beast is a story about looking beyond the physical, we want to portray that in a visual way. We're going minimalist. No set, just a white backdrop. And no props, just imagination. And no costumes. I, I mean, there are costumes. Of course our actors wear clothes. I, lots of clothes. I, well, not lots of clothes, just not period pieces or poofy yellow dresses. Okay, Cammie, that's, that's enough. You did great. Um, we're just trying this chick anyway, Blue. She really needs to loosen up. I'm loose, I swear. Plenty loose. If anyone needs to loosen up, it's that West kid. I know, right? But his sister-in-law is an old friend of the family, and she asked my parents if he could help out. Yeah, well, I'm definitely about keeping your folks happy. We're toast without the moolah. I just don't know about him. I heard he grows on you. I wouldn't mind him to begin with. He weren't such a smart aleck. I like it. It gets me on my toes. Well, if he's as half as smart with a camera, then I'm sure we'll be fine. Come on, you gotta be kidding me, man. <sighs> yep, just fine and beat. No, He's chewing out a police car. officer. I think they're arguing over a parking ticket. I was in a rush. I just, I to that cop means business. Uh, Saw so at least three cars with parking tickets outside earlier. Uh, <sighs> I guess his inner James Dean can't hang. Not even man enough to own up to a parking ticket. Wow, Cammie, I've never heard you, heard you be this harsh about anyone. Yeah. We're pre-programmed not to trust the pretty ones, Blue. <laughs> Now take note of this, Cam. That's a tried and true lollyism. That's material we can use. <laughs> and speaking of material, which class are you subbing for today? Oh, I cannot be late! <laughs>